Hello, Diagos here. Welcome back to my Factorio series, The Manhattan Project. So while we are continuing to fill up the main bus with iron and copper, um, I do want to have some solar panel array parts being constructed so that they're ready for us because power is getting uh, to be a, a little bit of a problem. And we're going to be adding more miners and more furnaces, of course, will be running. So... We need that uh, pretty soon. So what we're going to need um, are really mainly three components. Uh, solar panels, which require steel, electronic circuits, and copper plates. And then accumulators, which are iron plates and batteries. So that's not a problem. We have all of this stuff already. Um, and then over here, we're going to need some substations, um, which require the red circuits. And then steel and copper as well. <clears throat> okay. And then, of course, we're going to need some other stuff like uh, robo ports, which we already have, and power poles. But for now, we'll do three of these things right here, I think. And we can kind of start. We're going to give them a little extra space, I think, and uh, not crowd it out a bit. Start right here. Okay, so this one will be solar panels, right? And I think I want to have if I put down four of those. Yeah. So I'd like to have four of these because we're going to use a lot of them. So they're going to need copper, steel. I think we'll do that on one line uh, because the accumulators need they don't need either of those. Okay, so we'll do that separately. Uh, these need copper and steel, so we'll put those up here. And then we can put green circuits and red circuits on a, their own line as well. So that'll be substation, right? Okay, so we'll have steel and copper and green circuits and red circuits, something like that. Okay. Um, and then for the accumulators, I want pretty much the same number. It's it's not quite the same. It's a little less than the solar panels, um, but it'll work out to about the same number of accumulators uh, to solar panels. So I'll do four of those as well. And we'll just do a separate line for that. So let's let's actually first do these, do these so that I know where I'm gonna do the output. Okay, so we'll put these in chests, I think. And then have some. Right. And these will be provider chests because we might want to call these up later. So we need. Maybe I just get three, two. Okay. <clears throat> and we'll just separate because we, we want them to kind of fill up anyway. These can be like that. And we'll just let these fill up because I think we'll have a lot, want a lot of power. And we'll be using them a lot anyway. Um, okay, so next over here, we will do the four accumulators. I'm doing four because I want them to, to build quickly. Um, they get used up very fast. All right, let's see what we got here in science. Uh, we'll keep researching this, I guess, for now. Okay, so we need just one belt here of batteries and steel. Okay, and our batteries and iron, I mean. And we need to put down the chests. There we go. And I will not fill those up either. How many do they use? Five. You know what? I'm going to change my mind. I'm going to do two. I don't want them to get too out of control. Okay, so they're all two, two stacks, but they'll, they'll produce more quickly, right? And if I let it go, then I'm not totally wasting resources there. I might change that later, though. 
<clears throat> okay, so this one is going to be copper and steel. We have to bring down the copper line now. There we go. Copper will come in. Let's say we need to give it some room to join. Let's say uh, <clears throat> I'm probably do steel here and copper there. All right. And we want to get the steel line. Steel lines gonna go right here. Let's let's do that first. There'll be two steel lines, of course. And uh, probably need to do the same thing here <clears throat> for these. Bots coming and taking the red belt off me. That's good. Okay, so yes, so steel is going to be right here, and um, we can just jump the line a bit there. And the steel line can jump that. Okay. Okay, so we should have Let's do it back down here. Okay, we'll do that and do that. Okay. We can come up I think to right here and those Oh boy, that is not what I want at all. Okay, and now I can unload a few of these there. Okay. Um, what do we next need? Iron, I think. Okay, and. Yeah, that's not any iron. Iron just needs to come over here. So we'll pull this one through for now. And uh, let's see, you'll come up. Yeah, we'll have to redo that anyway. Oh, whoops. I don't want that all to be iron. We do need batteries. And they're over here. All right, let's uh, do this. Do we want it right here? I think anywhere is fine. Like right, like this. This would be okay. <clears throat> Just kind of plotting it. These will be batteries. A slight issue. We can move him down to there, I think, is okay. All right.
Okay, so batteries will come up. Like this, and... We can actually do a little bit better than that. Iron will come up right here. Go. Okay, and then we just need to hook up the batteries. to do that just have a little extra station for them okay and pick you up now Is that a storage chest actually I think it was I'll put a storage chest back down here okay so we want to put a splitter here and an underground and that should hook up the batteries and now we can go check Here. All right, so we want power there. Okay. Add some lights, and I think we'll be done. Hmm. All right, so we've got <clears throat> accumulators going. Uh, we need to get circuits for these guys. Forgot about that. All right, green circuits coming up to here. Red circuits need more of those probably. Uh, let's see. Add a power here so that we can have a little bit of light. Okay. So for this, let's do this in reverse here, or come up here first. So we'll get some undergrounds like there and there, I think, and then work. Should not work actually, because there's some right there. Let's fix that. Up. Underground here. There. <clears throat> and we can kind of wiggle that a little bit like that I think I may need some more underground belts okay okay so you're plugged in right no you're not plugged in I think that's fine. Okay. And then... Ooh, that's a problem. There, we got a lot going on right here. <clears throat> okay, um... Oot. Do this one. I think I just need to come over one more. Okay, so we'll put you right here then. <clears throat> All right. And in fact, we don't need to use both of these because we can underground that. It'll save us a little bit of material and then we can do this sort of thing here. Maybe one it right there. Okay. Okay, that should work. <clears throat> so we need 
there to there. Then over copper. Okay. And then this one will go over the green circuits. Ah. Um, let's make you the green circuit dude and we'll make you the red circuit dude. All right, that should do it. There's our red circuits. <clears throat> okay, so we should get substations being made. There they are. And all of those. Okay, everything is cooking. We'll come back and we'll have a whole lot of accumulators and uh, solar panels to play with um, pretty soon. Awesome. All right, let's run back over here and see what we got going on in this area. Just checking on power as we run around. Okay, so steel. What's the deal with steel? It's still red belt is that the issue maybe maybe not well we can just convert everything anyway see what happens it's my motto part right here like I've said before some people will say that that's not necessary at all waste a blue belt but I've got lots of blue belt now so I don't care okay we'll just keep doing the efficiency that's fine all right so what else um, let's do a little test here get a new blueprint Can't brag. There we go. Okay, I want to see if there's any red belt in this area here. I have to be careful because right there you see there's red belt there. Um, I'll start with this, I think. There is some red belt. Ah, I see it's on the side over here. It's probably where I ran out before, and then down there. Okay, I don't see any more. Oh, I think I see some right there. That's a problem. Okay. <clears throat> so where was it? Right here? remember exactly. Oh, there it is. Okay, fast transport belt. Okay, so that got changed out. And then over here, which looks fine. There we go, right here. Okie doke. So, oh, right there. Okay. Probably it's okay, but 
I do want to get everything. There was some right there. Okay, let's do our little test again. We'll do the map. And we'll get right here. Three red belts. Where are you? Where are the three red belts? Cannot see them. I'm trying to zoom in. Oh, there. I, I see one, two, right there. One, two. Anybody? I can do... I don't see it. I can do uh, another, like, pass with the... Oh with the blueprint on like the smaller sections and it will are you there okay so there's a few right there i didn't get that all in the, the uh, blueprint though okay let's do it like this okay so any in this section here one okay this section here none all right just keep isol isolating it down none there none there there's one there's one none where was it Oh, there it is over here somewhere there it is right there okay <clears throat> bingo baby and that's how you find a little bottlenecks going the wrong way though okay cool all right how is steel looking though see it's still not It's still not going a full belt. I am. I mean, it's not even coming down like all the way to like right here. I know it's getting taken off the, li the line, but I would expect this to be full, right? Of steel. Maybe I'm confused and maybe steel needs more. I don't think that's true. I think it should be about the same. Um, I mean, we can look that up between episodes um, I might just be also having a slight deficiency in the iron here but I think that could be the case all right well I'm gonna look this up and just kind of see what's going on um, but we'll check that out in the next episode so thanks for watching and I'll see you next time